is not our abilities that show us what we truly are, it is our choices. Hi, I'm Coach Eric from Pittsburgh Fit with your PF Go workout for today. We're going to go ahead and start our warm up off with a 600 meter run. This should take about three-ish minutes of uh, cardio effort. So if you don't are, you don't feel like running, you can jump on a bike or rower or do some burpees or up-downs or helms, whatever floats your boat. But we want to do that first 90 seconds or so, kind of at an easy pace, and then that second 90 seconds, I want you to go a little bit faster. Then the next part of our warm-up, we have step-ups, air squats, and plank shoulder taps. So we will boxer, um, race through and step up with one, one leg, and then step down and switch legs. She's going to do this for 10 total reps. It'll end up being five on each leg. After that, she's going to go ahead and sit over here. She's at she has some plank shoulder taps. She's going to do 20 plank shoulder taps here. Opposite hand to opposite shoulder. Notice how her hips are not moving a lot. We want to be as steady and stable as possible and shift your weight so you're not all over the place. After that, she's going to hop up for 10 air squats. So she's going to find her squat stand. She's going to shoot her hips back. Sit down. Nice squat position. Just like so. Beautiful. We're going to go through that one more time. And now we're going to move on to our workout. No strength. Today, just going straight to the workout. Our workout today is Imam style for 30 minutes. We have three different movements that we're going to be doing, and we're going to be going through each movement, we're going to spend two minutes on it. So it's every two minutes for today. So minutes one and two, you have calories and cardio. Round number one, I want you going for either 25 or 20 calories. Round three and four, you're going to go for 27 or 22 calories. And then round five, 30 or 25. So every round that you get onto your bike or rower, I want you to go ahead and step it up a little bit and add a couple of calories. Then on minutes three and four, you're going to be doing 10 dumbbell goblet step ups and then max box jump. So I'm going to have Grace pull on to the zone on the goblet position, show up to the goblet position here. Just like so, you can also do this with a kettlebell. She's going to go right back into the step ups. Just like we did in the warm up, alternating legs. She's 10 total or five on each side. As soon as she hits the night, she's going to put up the dumbbell up to the side and go right into a box jump. She's going to do max box jump for the remaining time. You'll probably have just over a minute to do that. Um, so release them out appropriately. Make sure you grab the breath at the top of the jump. Now notice the question lands in the power position. Lands, stands, and then steps down. Perfect. If you don't feel comfortable jumping, you can always um, ditch the weight and then go right into body weight step ups instead. That is totally fine. Minutes five and six, you have a 200 meter run and then right into a max plank. So you're going to run 200 meters. I want this to be pretty fast. 200 meters is a short distance. It should take you right around 40 to 45 seconds. And then inside, you're going to go right into a plank. And you're going to hold that for the rest of the time, which will probably be about a minute or just over a minute. Alright guys, long workout today. Have fun, have a great workout, have a great